doesn't it doesn't come across in TV, just the loudness of it as you walk in or the voices. So is it the first have you have you read the Quran before? Read the saw of it, yeah. You have? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What's your what's your take on it? Because you did say that you have some kind of interest towards it. Yeah. I know it's so hard. People the conversations seem to slow easily. When I'm watching TV, I'm just stuck for words. So okay, okay, like, oh, okay. So just so so, so Okay, so what do you what do you know about Islam so far? Do you know our belief system? Yeah, so believe in uh, Muhammad. Yes, as a, as, as a prophet. So he's a prophet of God. So right. we believe in one God. Which is God Almighty, Allah, and we don't we negate partners. So we don't believe that God Almighty has partners. We don't believe that Prophet Muhammad is a Godhead, or he's like God, or he shares the attributes of God. So the same thing that we um, ask the Christians, yeah. that we say, look, yeah, one second, yeah, yeah, no, 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 here, yeah, bro, I, I get too many. Yeah. So the thing is. What I'm saying is that as Christians, what they do is they deify Jesus. Right. So what they do is they give the credit that belongs to God to Jesus. Yeah. And we say that's wrong. Yeah. Because you would accept clear that God Almighty, you believe in the Creator? Oh yeah. Okay, yeah. so God Almighty has created us. Right. The least that He deserves is our obedience and submission to His will. Yeah. Yeah, we don't want to as, as, uh, associate partners. Like, if you, do you have children? No. Okay, if you have kids, imagine your child turning around to you and saying, Mom, you've done nothing for me. I'm going to go and thank Ali. Right. And imagine you brought them up, you changed their nappies, you fed them, you looked after them, you brought them to this age, and they turn around and say, Mom, I don't know you. No, I'm not even going to call you mum. I'm going to call you a person. Excuse me, person. I don't want to know you. I'm going to go and thank Ali. How would you feel? It's, it's, it's ingratitude, disrespect, ungratefulness. You know, these are the things. Now, when it comes to God Almighty, God Almighty doesn't move with emotions. But it's a transgression against Him. So what all God asks us to do is worship Him alone. When you need something, ask Him. The biggest blessing that I have in my life as a Muslim, 10 years, is that I have that personal relationship with God. In good times and bad times, I turn to Him when I need Him. And that is amazing, to know that there's someone higher than you, looking out for you, and wants the best for you, exactly, closer to you than the juggler vein, like you know, Claire. So the thing is, why is stopping you from accepting Islam? Why is stopping you from becoming a Muslim? Because you seem like a very nice lady, you seem sincere. I have, like, said the shahad over and over, it's just like the commit myself to like the prayer five times a day and the full fasting about... Take it, okay, take it step by step, yeah? So, do you believe in one God? Yeah. Do you believe Jesus was a prophet? Do you, do you believe he's God or not God? Not God. Okay. God's son, man, that I'll Okay, so son, the sons of God, sons of uh, God in the Bible is in the tongues. Right. And it, it, it's different different people that he refers to. Yeah. It doesn't literally mean he's like born of no. God. Yeah. Exactly, he's a righteous person, you know. Yeah. So do you believe the prophet Muhammad, peace upon him, be the final prophet? Yeah. You understand? I am, I'm not. So, 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 so. I mean, I'm not sure, Muslim, I'm not doing my have, prayers. Have, have, you, have, you, have you taken a shahad? Like, like, to claim. Not, not publicly, I don't think I'm just saying that. So, so, what's, what's stopping you? You can do it with me. Okay. You sure? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Alright, um. Alright, okay, that's interesting. <laughs> you know, I, I, I always... I am being sincere, no, I'm not no, just I can, saying... No, I can see that in you, I can see that in you. I can see that in you, I can see that in you, you know. Why don't we, just before we do the Shahada, have a prayer inside you to God, and say, God, can you give me a sign through the Qur'an? Oh, good idea, right? Yeah, and open up a random verse, and pick, pick, uh, pick, pick a verse. Make a which, which, which I verse? Appear, so 14. 14, let's read it. So, Surah Rum, it's 14, yeah? And the day the hour appears, that day will become separated. And as for those who had believed in the righteous deeds, they will be in gardens of paradise. Yeah? <laughs> but as for those who disbelieved and denied our verses, the meeting of the hereafter, those will be brought into the punishment. So exalted is Allah when you reach the evening and when you reach the morning and to him all praise is due throughout the heavens and the earth. And he exalted is at night and when you are and, and when you are at noon. He brings the living out of the dead and brings the dead out of the living and brings to life the earth after the lifelessness and thus will you be brought out. So God Almighty is talking about the people who believe and the people who disbelieve and that God Almighty is saying how exalted he is 
and that he brings the dead from the living and the living from the dead. Yeah. And you are now ascribing this to God, not Jesus. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. So that subhanallah shows you that people like you who believe and die on belief that God has promised paradise. Yeah. Anything that you wish for, anything that you want, you will be given. And I believe that is amazing. And you can repeat after me. Yeah? So just repeat after me. Ashadu Allah ilaha illallah wa ashadu anna muhammadan rasulullah. Okay, can repeat after English. I bear witness. I bear witness. There is nothing worthy of worship. There is nothing worthy of worship. Except Allah. Allah. And the Prophet Muhammad, the Prophet Muhammad. And, Jesus. and Jesus, peace be upon them, peace be upon them. Are, the are the final messenger. The final messenger. Allah. <laughs> sisters, oh. you can give hug to um, the sisters maybe. Okay, this was very interesting. We had, we had, <laughs> we had Sister Claire. Would you like a free Quran? She came and introduced. It doesn't bite. It's okay, don't worry. Yes. Um, oh. oh, where's she gone? She. Oh. Do you want me to get her? I have a feeling. Yeah, yeah. Can you get? Can you get? Yeah, I'll go get her. Claire. No, no. Don't worry about the mic. Don't worry about the mic. Leave the mic. Leave the mic. Yeah, just. I was just gonna say a few things. So basically, yeah. <laughs> before you go. So we have. You got Quran, yeah? Okay. Yeah. So basically, we have a new program right. where we. Um, Help people if they want to learn how to pray step by step. Yeah. But yeah, so I would say um, now you're a Muslim, inshallah. We believe that all your sins are forgiven. It's like you're like a newborn baby. So I would say have a relationship with God Almighty. Anytime you need anything, turn to Him. Yeah. Um, if you need anything, we're here. So if you write this down, salahplus.com. And uh, you got the pen there? Oh, no, I don't. You, uh, you don't have a phone? Is anyone? Oh, yeah, I do. I do. I do. Let me write for you, yeah? Let me write to you. So if you go to this website, it's our website. If you want to learn how to pray, um, you can book a session or we can send you a guided prayer mat, yeah? yeah? So it's www.salahplus.com So if you go there, you can get a free guided prayer mat. Um, do, do we have any guided prayer mats? Okay, you can get one delivered, right. um, and if you want to book a session uh -huh. for someone to come and teach you, or a sister's team, they yeah. can teach you how to pray. Right. You have, any other questions you have? Uh, no, I'm just okay. going to watch it. No Thank problem. you so Thank much. You very much. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you for your time. Can I get my... Okay, no problem. <laughs> saying, no problem. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Okay. Yes. Thank you. So yeah, Thank, Thank you. you. Take care, Claire. Look after yourself. Yes. Um, so yes, uh, brothers and sisters, inshallah, as you can see, you know, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala guides. Our job is to convey, but she's from Edinburgh. Um, uh, she's from Glasgow, from Scotland. She came here, she said she felt close to Islam. There's a lot of things that she believes anyways. So we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to guide her and accept her from us inshallah and purify her intentions inshallah. From Salam Kona, till next time, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.